A snapshot of life without United Way funded agencies in Northeast Michigan. Without the homework rescue program, at risk students in sixth through eighth grades in Alpena County would suffer. Last year alone, nearly 1,000 kids would not have had a safe place to study and get tutoring. Kids who suffer in school suffer in life. They have lower graduation rates and higher incarceration rates, and our entire community pays the price. Without the Alzheimer's Association, hundreds of community members with dementia would be living in more fear and doubt. And caregivers would be living with more worry and stress, watching this devastating disease take hold of their loved one. Without the Salvation Army in our community, hundreds of families would be living in hunger. That is raw. We would have even more hungry kids in empty, cupboard households. In the bitter winters, we would have more people living in the cold and dark, unable to pay their heat and power bills. Without the Salvation Army, at-risk kids would not have a safe outlet during the summer months, and they may never see better choices for their own lives. They would be more likely to follow in the same footsteps of poverty, substance abuse, and criminal behavior that they have seen modeled for them at home. Without the Sunrise Mission, nearly 300 people would be without a home, living on the streets or in unsafe conditions. They would not have a clean or warm bed. They have no other means to care for themselves and build a better future. Without the Sunrise Mission, one woman who struggled with substance abuse and all the barriers that creates would likely to be on the streets without hope. After four months at Sunrise Mission, she was able to learn skills, move into her own apartment, and help others. She's been clean and sober for over a year. Without the Boys and Girls Club, last year alone, 1,542 kids in our community would be left at home alone, potentially wandering the streets, making unsafe choices, or just killing time. They would not have access to sports programs to help them be healthy and strong. They would not have access to art programs to express their creativity. There would be fewer smiles, fewer high fives, and valuable relationships. Without the Boys and Girls Club, more than 700 kids in our community would not have had the opportunity last year to volunteer by helping residents at Turning Brook and Tender Care, packing food, and participating in park cleanups. Without the Boys and Girls Club, a young boy named Josh, who started with the Youth Volunteer Corps as a shy and introverted young man with a learning disability, struggling from the loss of his father from cancer, would not have gone on to college and become an ambassador for other youth who are struggling. Without the Alpena Volunteer Center, a student with handicaps would not have had the opportunity to overcome shyness and feel a part of a team by participating with classmates in a ropes course. Without Shelter Inc., last year alone, 108 dependent children of victims and survivors would not have received vital services like crisis intervention, trauma counseling, and child care. Without Shelter Inc., 3,362 emergency shelter bed nights would not have been provided. 829 counseling sessions would not have been given, leaving victims and survivors to suffer in silence. Without Shelter Inc., a young woman with two small children, pregnant with her third, who suffered years of physical and verbal abuse, would not have had the support to change her life. Yet today she carries a full class load, has become a licensed LPN, and found safe housing. She can now pursue her dream of working in the Pediatric Cancer Center at U of M where her own son received treatment and was saved. The future of Alpena and the surrounding communities without thriving agencies funded by the United Way is bleak. Please give today.